The Frankfurt sewer murders were an unexplained murder series of male adolescents in the Frankfurt Rhine Main area during the 1970s and 1980s. The killings took place from 1976 to 1983. The victims were seven boys and male adolescents aged between 11 and 18 from Frankfurt or the Offenbach station area where some of them may have worked as prostitutes and met the culprit. The boys' hands were tied to the back with a rope or cord and then killed by apparent blood force. For some, however, death presumably occurred by drowning in the sewerage. Due to long submersion in the sewage and partly strong damage to the corpses by screw conveyors, the victims were identified relatively late, and on only one, clear signs of blunt force trauma to the head had been found. The criminal psychologist Rudolf Egg suggested that the suspect might be a single person at the age of about 50 years without family ties or friends. It is possible that the culprit himself had been a victim of sexual abuse and may therefore have developed a disturbed relationship with his own homosexuality or with other same-sex people. His inclinations apparently include sadistic bondage. The suspect likely moved from Gießen to Frankfurt at the end of 1970s and lived out his fetishes in the local milieu. He had also been familiar with the area, and was highly mobile. The fact that he threw his victims into the sewerage after violating them is probably a hint to a deep-rooted hatred.